Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. <coughs> um, Kansas City Chiefs, that's that's all I can tell you. Um, heck of a game, you know it's going to be. Um, there was some opportunity that the Chiefs really could, could have been up by 14 points. But that tended to happen. Um, the Chiefs have the type of offense that they can just keep on going. They can keep on going because they they just well team and well. It's a it's a it's, it's a it's a, a smart oil machine. I mean, we they have three key people and we still kept on going because the just type of quarterback you have it's it's amazing when you see greatness um and this is just a great player i mean to see michael jordan you know everybody knows that michael jordan is the goat but to see him to do things and do it when it counts that's just so important um and this is just a better Chiefs team. This is a better Chiefs team. It's a better defensive team. Um, it's a better. It's actually a better offensive team. Now Tyreek Hill, just just a phenomenal player, and you can't replace that. But as long as you got number fifteen, anything is possible. I mean, the man is brilliant. Um. But Joe Burrow, make no mistake, that's the assassin that can can take you out and you never see it coming. He's just that good. And if he just had a little bit more help on the offensive line, he, he could have scorched us. I say been up by seven points. Um but they just played better. Um they defense and came. Chris Jones, he came with them sacks where it was needed. Um, it's just an impressive beat um, by by the Kansas City Chiefs. Now, the Eagles is going to be a problem. They can run it up on you. But I think we can beat them. I think we can contain uh, Hurts. I I know that he doesn't do good playing from behind. Um, I watched him since Alabama, watched him from Oklahoma. He's good, but he's great. He's better than good. He's much better than he was last year, but he doesn't play well from behind. If the Chiefs can offensive weapons and just beat up by 14, it's a struggle. And for him, passing, you know, he's good, but he's not a passing assassin. They're a play option. They're a run option team um, uh, with a play action background and, and, and a mobile um, quarterback. That's, that's going to be a problem. But, you know, I think because the Chiefs <coughs> have been in this spot before, um, they'll be ready. I think the Eagles going to be good. Um, it can go either way. It can, the, Eagles, the Eagles can blow us out by 14 points, or the Chiefs can come and, and beat them at the last play. It, it, it's kind of funny that way, um, but we'll see. We'll we'll see uh, what's going to happen. It's going to be a good Super Bowl. Um, I'm always happy when there's any type of minority quarterbacks because that's a position they say we're not capable of doing. But here we are. But I think that myth is long gone. You know, as long as you can win, it don't matter what your skin color is. Anyway, uh, that was a heck of a game. I couldn't rest. I couldn't. I couldn't go to bed properly because I was just so pumped. Um, 
I, I surely thought he was gonna miss that um that uh is uh that that kick and then we're gonna go to overtime and I think Burr could have beat us. But um that's that's a good lesson for Cincinnati. Don't be making these who's your daddy and you know this and I know that's a part of the game trash talking but you better win so you can go ahead and talk it and you got the right to do it but when you lose you need to eat humble pie and I haven't seen it but I know the city of Cincinnati seems like a good city uh, small market team like Kansas City but it's and I understand the swagger I understand you know the swagger the Detroit Pistons, the, you know, it's swagger when you can, when you can do it. But it's better when you when you're professional and classic. People will like you more. But um, yeah, you know, we're just a better team. So go Chiefs.